What's going on guys? Uh, Don Place here, welcome to the channel. Um, first of all, before we get into this video, um, I just want to say appreciate the um, support, sort of new subscribers, views, um, my 37 and 10 ACR terminal game actually hit 1k views and that's just insane because I didn't think any of my videos would hit 1k. Appreciate it, it means a lot. Um, yeah, if you pass through my channel, enjoy the content, more than welcome to subscribe. Um, and yeah, so now, um, with today's video, um, in the comments section, I keep getting, why does my graphics look like this? Um, so today I'm actually going to show you what I'm using, uh, what FOV changer I'm using for Modern Warfare 2 2009, um, peripheral preference, um, I'll show you my settings that I have as well, if you just want to copy, or if you want to mess around with yourself, um, but this hopefully this video clarifies on why my graphics look the way they look. Um, video, you know, it's just the settings I'm using runs perfectly fine. Um, I will do a short video at some point of the setup that I've got. Um, yeah, so that that will be a uh, a video for another time. All right, so to get before I get into it, I'm just gonna go. I'm just I haven't loaded I have not loaded the FOV changer up. Um, so I've just loaded up Modern Warfare 2, and that's it. And then I'll exit and load up the FOV changer, and sh show you the difference. Oh, just um, choose any team. Assuming deathmatch. <clears throat> Alright, so I know you guys are probably probably not used to seeing I, I cannot play Modern Warfare 2 like this um, I probably could but I, I prefer the FOV changer um, so this is just what it looks like um, without the FOV changer, because it does have other things which I'll get into. Now, I'll exit. Um, I'll completely exit the game. You don't need to completely exit. You can do it in game. That's right. So, I don't want to invite. So, I'll exit. Um, yeah, so. It's called Lindra, Lindra Market, uh, Market by Lindra. Um, yeah, I wouldn't, don't know what this is, um, never touched it, um, I suggest, I haven't even clicked into it, so I'd probably suggest not even going into it. So, I'll obviously show you how to download it, and I'll attach the link, I'll attach the uh, link in the description of this video for anyone that wants to use it. Um, I'll also even show you Diddy Gamer as well. Um, just so you guys know how it's run. So you click run. Now when you first set up it's going to show like this. But once you adjust your field of view settings you go over to the settings bar. Um, save your config. And then before you load up MW2, or I just do it before I load it up. Um, I just go MW2 load continue. You'll get this unlocker, this um, error. Just hit continue and then just open up Modern Warfare 2 again. Um, there's been no records um, of VAC bands. But it does say use your own risk. I've obviously been using this for a while, have not been banned. Um, I'd say it's pretty safe. Uh, let me just um, oh, can you enable um, the start? So you can't do it, can you? I don't think so. Uh, now we'll just load up Modern Warfare 2 with um, market. FOV changer. Assuming death match. Um, 
I prefer to play it like this. Like, like I said, it, uh, it's personal preference. Um, if you guys like it, I'll show you my settings, and you can copy it from the video, or you can muck around it with it yourself. Um, so this is just what it looks like with the FOV change, and obviously there is other settings you ch um, could turn on and off, which I'll also show you. But yeah, so this is basically, I prefer it like this. Um, the brightness is a lot better. Yeah, and I'm playing in like uh, 100 FOV. Um, I, I don't really like playing on 120. Um, 190 to 100 is my prefer FOV. But yeah, this is basically it. Like, this is it's what it does. It's a lot cleaner. A lot brighter. You can then it's a draw. Stand down. see what you're shooting at. So yeah, so this is just is basically why my game looks like that. So I'll tab out. So this is the website where you download it. Um, so you, what you do is you scroll down, click, I'll just open up a new tab. Just click on download the latest version. And it'll automatically up. It will automatically download, and then you just got to extract it, um, and then bang, it's good to go. Um, so yeah, you basically just um, you just click on Lindra dash market exe. It's literally, or you can copy it to a folder on your desktop. I think either way, it's still gonna work. And then yeah, you just and that's and that's all you do. Um, now, so if you go, so I had not I've not played around with this. Um, I've kept this default. Now, I'll just minimise the. Um, so this is my thing. So I got light map, extra bright. Um, I have. You have to use your down arrows. Yeah, you have to use your up and down arrows to change. Um, I've gone to normal, uh, um, and it just goes, just dark. Um, extra bright is the pre one, is the preferred one. I prefer. Um, specular map we um, we disabled. We disable it. We turn off the movie. Um, the no, we got no fog, no glow, no bullet, no camos. But I actually might even have my camos on. So. Now all you do here is just go, see I've named mine just MW2, MW2, hit save, and then click load, continue, and that's it. Yeah, so my field of view, so that, yeah, so that's basically, it. that's why, um, that's why my game looks like that, because I've turned these all on. Um, and now for the field of view, I play at 90, I just put 333 for the max SPS. I'll leave this, I've put this to 1000, I'll leave this at 1. And and that's literally, and that's basically, um, like, I, so I'll go back and I'll leave it on there for a few seconds so you guys can, if you want to copy mine, more than welcome. Um, but it's it's personal preference on what you choose. Um, but yeah, that's so. It that's why my game looks the way it does is because of these settings. Um, and yeah, that, and that's basically. It. And then once you've done all that, you just go to settings, save, and then and then load, and, and then load up your game. And yeah, you, you're good to go, and makes the game a lot brighter. Um, I'm not really fussed about the graphics. To me, like f for a game that was made in 2009, um, obviously graphics at that point weren't as good as they are now. Um, but yeah, that's the reason why my, my when I play Modern Warfare 2, that's why my it looks like that because of these settings. Now I know everyone's asking. 
I know there was other people asking about if it's through Steam. Um, it is through Steam. Um, I'll also put the Diddy Gamer website um, link in the description as well. So basically, Modern Warfare 2 is done just by dedicated servers. You go on to DiddyGamer.com uh, um, and then basically you'd click. Say I want to join this free for all game, just click and go open link while you have your game running and it'll automatically connect you into that game and yeah so this is basically this is basically what we use to play Modern Warfare 2 um, so I'll have that and I have the market um, by Lindra link in the description of this video um, so if you guys want to download it um, if you guys want to come play um, servers are normally full um, but yeah so um, that's basically it um, have any problems just um, post in the comments and uh, we'll, um, and I'll try to help you out as much as I can alright guys we hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one Bye, guys.